Hello. All right. Uh, first few hours in Slovenia. Uh, it's a beautiful country, and guess what? Found it. That's the third and last monument that was on my list. Um, I'm in Ilurska Bastricia right now, and that's just uh, it's about a 20-minute drive from the uh, Slovenia-Croatia border, and we got this thing behind me. Um, I'm really not sure at all what this one is supposed to be. Um, it's in the middle of this kind of this kind of park in the middle of the of the town. Um, there's like there's some tanks and anti-air guns uh, over there, and so I, I'm just gonna assume that it's World War II related. This one, or at least if not that, then something in the 1950s. But uh, yeah, this thing is really pretty neat. I tried for a good. 10-15 minutes to get up inside there, but it is, despite how accessible it looks, it is really not. I would need, like, another person or, like, a milk crate or something to get on top of there because, you know, I need a boost, and it is, it's difficult, but, uh, it, it, it looks a little small right now, but if you get right up next to it, then I assure you, it is, uh, it's actually pretty sizable. All right. Yeah, so... This one's at least, uh, you know, 20, 30 feet high maybe, and it's got these really cool, like, warpy concrete columns in the middle. I have no idea what this is supposed to symbolize, but uh, I think I'm just going to call it, like, the stretchy box from now on. So, there we go. That's all my monuments off the list. Tomorrow, I, uh, I'll catch that train, and I'll head back to Brussels, and it'll be back to the old European grind. So... Hope you enjoyed this, I certainly did. It was a little out of the way, have to deal with some language barriers, but it's cool and it's fun. Till next time.